concerned about the spread of the Ebola virus disease in Nigeria and West Africa, the National Union of Textile, Garment and Tailoring Workers is gathered here with some doctors. The agenda of this gathering of the National Union of Textile, Garment and Tailoring Workers of Nigeria and members of other unions in Lagos is to prevent the Ebola virus disease from making inroads to their workplaces. Participants comment more on the dreaded disease. If Ebola is discovered in some neighboring West African countries that have fewer or lesser population, it may not be news. But if Ebola comes to Nigeria with about 160 million people, comrades, that is catastrophic. This sensitization is put together to address what I call the six W's of Ebola viral disease. Namely, what is it? Who can contact it? Where can it be transmitted? How can it be contained? Where can it be fatter? And which measure can be taken? Up north, journalists in Kaduna are determined to disseminate information, even in remote parts of the state. We are going to go around by the grace of God to hold town hall meetings, not at local government headquarters, but at the most inner part of rural uh, area in a particular local government, so that this message can spread. We have, we have the tools and we have the medium to ensure that this thing goes round. The awareness is spreading. After getting down, I make sure I wash my hands before touching anything or before eating. As the message gathers momentum, it is hoped that people would comply with safety regulations as this would help reduce the chances of the virus spreading. Everyone is from a family and people in families work. When people don't observe good hygiene, they can spread germs to members of their families and colleagues through their hands. So the first and the best rule is wash your hands often. Mary Alale Yusuf, Channels Television.